Good morning. This is my favorite moment. I'm Tim Wright, president of the board, and we're introducing View from the Board, which you'll get to hear about 90 seconds from Sundays going forward so that you will know our board better than you ever have before. Concerning me, maybe better than you have ever wanted to before. <laughs> but I want to make three announcements for you today. Um, good news, sad but promising news, and really good news. The first good news is the hard work that Neil Fireeyes will stand up. Laura, <laughs> Laura, don't sit down. Laura McIntyre. And Patty Kiernan. Stay up, even though this is not your first time here. They have done remarkable work in answering the question about membership. They have also generated a very long <laughs> email to all of you that you should have received. It's really interesting reading, but most importantly are the lines I've highlighted. We have decided to revert our membership roles back to last fall before the annual meeting. If you were a member then, you are still a member now. That's the good news. The sad but promising news is that two members of our board have stepped down, Kelly Glover and Laurie Pleak, who were wonderful, exciting, vibrant members. They made their own decision and chose to step away. That's sad because I love them both. I had the opportunity to work with both of them. The promising news is that we will now be looking for two new members, two new trustees or of our board of trustees. If you are interested, if you want to know more, find a member of the board, a trustee. We will be circulating. We will be in Friendship Hall or on the patio after service today. It's the third Sunday. It's the meet and greet your board. And ask us about the board, about serving on the board. I'll tell you now, it ain't going to be easy for the next year. Not at all. Not at all. So take a deep breath before you ask the question because we're going to give you the straight and honest answer. Okay? The really promising news, the third point, point that I want to make, is that we have an opportunity now to, each and every one of us, contribute like never before to the well-being of Unity Church of the Hills, and not by digging into our pockets, but digging into our hearts and volunteering. Find something that you want to do, whether on a Sunday or during the week, to make this place as good, better, best as it can be. That's the view from the board. I want to tell you one more thing, and I'm probably over my 90 seconds. Jack Frick, stand up, please. That's Jack Frick. Jack Frick has a <laughs> Jack Frick has a long and wonderful history, just as Jack Frick. But two Sundays ago, he came up and gave me a belated Christmas present, six pairs of socks. He said, Tim, I know what you've been going through, and I know it ain't easy, so I'm giving you these socks. I wore a pair today. Most of the socks have at the top of the socks some figure of teeth gnashing or brow beating or something like that because he knows what the board is going through. He's been there before. Thank you, Jack. Glad to have you here.